Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. And today I'm going to show you the New Year's update on my Nepenthes and carnivores. So first let's see the, and have a view of my orchids. This is about to flower. I'll update you guys when it does flower. This is also another orchid species. First let's go into the bog area first. I'm propagating some Venus fly traps. And these uh, are Pinguicula and Drosera Adelaide. Drosera Adelaide was basically a Drosera plant and it currently has three plants in one pot. Three plants in one growth, which has three different growth points. Now we're going to move on to our Nepenthes. Here are the Mirabilis bulcarensis and Floralia reflegiana vicii cuttings I did. Hopefully they will root, especially this one I need. I really want this to grow an equal point since it's, it's already having roots. Let's move on. This is Floralia vicii, a hybrid created by my local nursery and it has really funky growth habits like this tendril that is uh, curling around currently no picture yet because the previous one is already is dried this is hookeriana also oh this is a hybrid between viking and Rafflesiana. Let's check out the larger picture. Here is the Hookeriana picture. Th this is Northiana Maxima, aka Miranda. This is the baby one. This is the large, the, seat, the larger one, rooted cutting. And this is the new one I got. What an extremely spectacular picture really small I know these are extremely beautiful plants next is this Mirabilis gracilis which is now currently trying to make a new picture then to my very favorite species that is endemic to my country Vietnam Campotiana Mirabilis Campotiana uh, and Nepenthes mirabilis are both endemic to Vietnam, so we can have this species. And this has a very beautiful picture here, and currently it's making a new one. Next is, on the list is Viking Ampularia. And this Viking Ampularia has a really beautiful new picture. And let me just switch the camera. The new picture is right here, really greenish. Let's move on and look. And pull Tiana Mirabilis picture here again. Very nice. This is another Mirabilis gracilis. Very beautiful, squatty, beautiful pictures. Let's switch on the most beautiful one. This is Gracilis variegated. Very nice. Even has a small basil. I could do a cutting on this, but I really want to keep that basil alive. And the last on this top section is Foralii Ame Vici. The only picture here. Very nice. It's like the Thoralii Vici I featured last video, but it's much more longer and tub tubular. Let's check the entire view of the garden up here. Now let's come down to my favorite species. I just got very beautiful. It has a really huge and bright future. This is Thoralii truncata squat, aka big dragon. This red dragon species is really beautiful, has a new picture coming up. And look at the size. 
let me show you the newest currently open picture. Thorleon Truncata squad is really huge and my local nursery has a really cheap price for a very beautiful hybrid. And this one is a really nice specimen. If I were to check in the picture, really nice. This picture is determined to build a very strong future and it even has some clovers on it. And now let's check the full spectrum. Today I'm going to view mostly on the Storlei Truncata since it's my favorite in the collection right now. And the second place goes to the VCI hybrids like the this Storlei Reflegiana Vichii and the Vichii Thorolei and Vichii Thorolei AMA. Thorolei Cross Truncata Squad is very beautiful. Thorolei is a highly endangered species in Vietnam. And Truncata, most of you know, endemic to the Philippines. And this is so beautiful. I'll update you guys on this picture too since it will open soon. And this will be a very good sign that this plant is healthy growing since it is leaf jumping like crazy. This is the length of the old picture. And let's move on. The new picture is like 33% larger, which means this plant is having a very huge leaf jump, which is a very good thing since this is the oldest leaf for the picture and let's compare it whoa that's huge so now let's put it back in place all the pictures intact and let's check on this my, one of my favorite variegated ones this is a gracilis variegated when I buy at the nursery, it got stuck to another gracilis variegated. So yeah, we have to get this picture off. It's still very beautiful. I like how the leaves are really whitish. And the basil is coming out variegated. So let's view a few more plants. This is the avocado plant I got. And this is the end of the video and hopefully you guys enjoy and i will post more carnivorous plant stuff on my channel and thank you for listening again and goodbye